How to convert your back coins into USDT on Trust Wallet. Hello guys, welcome to this new video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can convert your tokens of back coins into USDT using Trust Wallet, guys. So the first thing you want to do is to enter into your Trust Wallet. As you can see now, I am in here. And you might notice there are a few tokens that can't be swapped within themselves. So it might be a little annoying if you select your Bitcoin. In this case, I have Bitcoin that runs with the BEP2 networks. And I wanted to swap this one into USDT. So if I select what I'm going to pay, which is, the, which is this one, I'm going to select what I'm going to get. But the thing is that I can only pay using Ethereum, uh, grab Ethereum. Uh, so this is the few tokens that I can use for make the swap for making the exchange and if I wanted to select Bitcoin I am not able to see Bitcoin in here so I'm gonna see uh, another Bitcoin that works with another networks so what we want to do is to go back we want to go into browser and in here you want to tap pancakeswap.finance slash swap as you can see, I have it here in my history. So you just need to go in here. Now that we're in here, we want to go into connect and let's connect our trust wallet. Let's click in here. Now, as you can see, I'm already in here. You can make a profile if you want to. Now let's go into this part, it says trade. Now what you want to do is to select the token that you want to uh, convert. In this case, that would be the Bitcoin. I'm gonna select Binance Coin so you guys see what happens in here. And then after you make the confirmation, you just hit onto confirm swapped. Now the price is updated, I'm going to go into accept, confirm the swap, and this one is going to write direct us into our trust wallet. We just need to confirm the transaction, okay? So now that we've finished, we want to get out of the browser and go into our wallet. I'm going to go back, and you can see that our tokens are in here. This is the new price that I've just created, and if you can't see the theta, you have to go in here where it says manage tokens, and you select USDT and you enable this one so if you're using polygon network or you're using another network you just have to enable this ones and go into done and you might see it down in here guys so there you have it really really simple don't forget to like the video and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this kind of stuff thank you for watching the video and i'll be seeing you guys on the next one